Educause policy asked representatives from various associations, what do you think are the policy implications that arise with the increased use of big data and analytics? A number of states, uh, well over a dozen, are either talking about building performance-based funding systems or are currently implementing performance-based funding systems. And data is a large part of that. So we are definitely, uh, data is going to be driving the discussion in the next few years. ASCU has always been supportive of transparency. Um, ASCU and APLU formed the Voluntary System of Accountability, which was uh, it's an, you know, a, a, what we call a college portrait, which is a, a more information than what's um, and a better uh, presentation uh, of the institutional data to help consumers with uh, you know, their choices. One specific uh, initiative is the Achieving the Dream uh, initiative, which uh, involves um, well over 100 of our uh, member institutions now, uh, funded by a number of different foundations, particularly the Lumina Foundation. And that's really the, uh, the driving force behind that initiative, is improving student outcomes through this concerted use of, uh, of data. Now at the, at the, more, at the governmental levels, um, you know, like I mentioned, uh, there is a keen interest uh, in terms of being able to better access and better use particularly information about employment and earnings outcomes for our students. There is danger in uh, misuse of these analytics and also some danger to privacy of individuals that can arise. On the other hand, the power of correct data and analytics is so strong uh, in the policy sphere and in the uh, media that it is important to continue to try to develop the best analytics and data that we can. One thing um, that's been very important to, to NICU throughout its history um, is protection of student privacy. And obviously privacy issues are one thing that inevitably arise when you're talking about loads of data. Um, so we, we have, have felt that this continues to be an important value um, and one that we try to protect and, and try to make the case that it deserves a bit more attention. I think the other thing, obviously everybody, and particularly in education, recognizes the value of data to make better decisions. And what the temptation is when you have the capacity to gather so much is to go to the other extreme where rather than having too little information to make good judgments, you've got too much. The, the use of analytics, the use, uh, better use of data that institutions are collecting is essential for us to better understand how we're spending money and how we're allocating resources. And so from the business officer perspective, understanding where the resources are needed, where they're being spent, and how to best utilize resources, um, and importantly, will rely on more sophisticated use of the data that we're, that we're collecting. So analytics is increasingly becoming uh, critical for the business officer uh, as they think about future revenue needs uh, and spending for their institutions.